All right, I have to show you this awesome dehydrator that my husband got me because he's awesome. Uh, this, you can set it by time. So you would just say, you know, you want more time or you want less time. It goes up and down by a half hour. And then you can also set the temperature. Now you can decide what temperature you want it. And it has this handy dandy book and it shows you how long you should probably cook each, well, dehydrate each item. I tried the kale chips, which were awesome, except I didn't follow the recipe. I just threw things together because I was in a hurry and I put too much salt in it. So I followed the recipe, um, but it did get it to that crispy texture. This, it comes with five trays and this dehydrator was able to do, I did it all at once just because I wanted to try it out and see how it worked. It did like a huge bunch of kale, about this much kale, a banana and three green peppers all at once which was awesome I did take I did take the um, kale out sooner because it had gotten to the point it needed to be um, the green peppers I have to show you this this is three green peppers and I I grew a salsa garden because I want to make my own salsa and everything comes it ripens at different times and I didn't want the peppers to go bad and I was like, oh, I'll dehydrate them. So I cut them up into tiny pieces, the size I would want in salsa, and then simply dehydrated it. And when it comes time, when all the tomatoes ripen and everything, I can simply mix it all together and my green peppers are already all dehydrated. So awesome stuff. I also found like with the bananas, um, it's easier to get them off if like halfway through the drying time you go in and loosen them from the tray and then let them continue drying. Otherwise they dry really, hard to the tray so you can go in there and like um, yeah let's show you Ooh. so this is what one of the trays looks like and I have to show you the base too so the heat the dehydrator part just comes from here and then each tray has a hole in it so it can get up and it's plastic and then a metal mesh and it's so if you only need one tray you can put that on and then just put that on top and that's all right yep okay and or you can do it all at once it also has look at this i haven't tried all these but i want to try it you can make these awesome apricot coconut cookies in a dehydrator like you take these ingredients you pulse it together in a food processor and then put it on the tray and you can actually make like really healthy but still tasty cookies um, i'm going to make more of the the what is this the kale chips you can make beef jerky of course i think that's probably the one of the first things and then it has like the times for all the vegetables that you'd want to do i am excited to try it out in all the ways i've only done it with a few things but it worked so well and the plus with all of these together it fits nicely into my cabinet it's not too big or too bulky to try and fit somewhere it can easily store below in a cabinet and it's good to go